Uh, welcome to sunny Berlin, where I have a seafarer with me. Did I say that right? Almost, Saifia. Okay, Saifia. Uh, tut me light. Uh, first of all, could you tell us a bit about uh, Saifia? Um, Saifia is a fairy tale metal band. Um, we are together in this formation since the beginning of the year. And yes, we um, are a band, a metal band, which uh, sings songs and plays songs about fairy tales. Oh yes, uh, you have uh, labeled yourself as a fairy tale metal band. Uh, what kind of music is fairy tale metal? <laughs> Actually, it's uh, symphonic metal with a touch of fairy tales <laughs> with female vocals. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> okay. Do you want to say something? No. <laughs> okay. Uh, your latest album, uh, Once Upon a Time, was uh, released last year. Uh, what could you tell us about that album? Um, this album is um, the first uh, step into the fairy tale world. So each song uh, tells a fairy tale, famous fairy tales from Hans Christian Andersen and Brothers Grimm, and uh, we like it a lot because we really enjoy playing with the themes. <laughs> Anyone else? Mm, no. No? Okay. That's all. Uh, outside the lyrics, uh, from where do you draw inspiration for your music? Hmm, that's quite difficult. For the music, it's. Um, well, the lyrics are uh, basically the the fairy tales, uh, in uh, told in some news stories or uh, maybe uh, just told them a little bit different than most of the people know them. And the music is, um, I would say, of course, a, a, a um, great uh, or big symphonic metal bands like Nightwish um, are inspiration for us all, but. Also, um, bands from other genres, like um, some from the punk or hardcore genre, or uh, metalcore, or even uh, Tori Amos is a big uh, influence on the vocals, I guess. And yeah, you want to say something to it? And everything what comes in mind uh, from the real life um, can inspire can be inspiration too. Nothing? <laughs> Nothing to say. <laughs> uh, I have to say that uh, yeah. for the latest album, Neil and me did the work because they joined uh, after we were halfway finished and they had to learn all the stuff uh, quite fast. <laughs> okay, and uh, on your webpage there's the uh, fairy tale of uh, Saifia. Uh, who has written that story with the multiple chapters? That was me. <laughs> yes, I um, I started to uh, think about the name. Saifia is a heroine. I invented her just for my own fun. <laughs> and um, we thought it was lovely to continue her story. And it's based on our own adventures. And um, it's a girl who becomes a warrior and um, has to go through a lot of adventures and she is also our band band's name <laughs> oh. oh yes yes uh, it brings for me it brings to mind uh, the computer game child of light so you uh, also uh, write the lyrics for the band yes. so uh, of course um, they are driven from uh, uh, fairy tales, but uh, is there some other source of uh, inspiration you draw from? Um, yes, I had as before we did uh, fairy tale songs and music. Um, I la had ideas about belief and uh, some kind of political stuff too, and everything that comes to my mind. And I think that the fairy tales are also something I feel in real life. And uh, sometimes they hint to something that happens in real life.
<laughs> uh, you are playing here in Blackland Berlin tonight. How important are live performances for you? <coughs> Actually, they're very important, but it's not uh, so easy to uh, perform a lot of uh, shows in uh, Germany at the moment because it's quite difficult for every smaller band to uh, get the locations or uh, yeah find other bands who have uh, the same music so you can uh, gamble a few people together to come to your shows but actually it's very important because this is uh, the way to uh, to show the the audience uh, what really your music is about I would say and yeah it's always a lot of fun I think mm -hmm. and what else brings us together brings us together <laughs> yes brings the people together <laughs> uh, so uh, what are your plans for the future for example uh, where do you see yourselves in a couple of years well I hope not in a wheelchair or something <laughs> <laughs> In a couple of years, I don't know. I can tell you where I, where I see myself tomorrow, but... <laughs> <laughs> Do you know something? For the next years? For the next years, um, yes, because we want to do <laughs> another album. <laughs> yeah. Um, well, it doesn't take a lot. Yes, we, um, of course, it's still fun for us, and we want to go on with uh, writing the music and the songs and play together, and hopefully we will, uh, we will be able to see other countries as well. Um, it, would, it would be very great to um, come outside of Germany. <laughs> and, yeah, and we are really spontaneous, so let's see what's happening. Uh, okay, uh, do you already have some ideas for a new album and uh, what kind of musical direction are you going to take? Uh, well, yes, we have. We are working on a, a new album, on new material for the next album. It uh, will basically be the same as before, uh, a little, mi little bit more orchestra and a little bit more metal guitars as well because now we got uh, two guitar players in the band we uh, used to have one only and with two guitar players you can do a little bit more uh, metal stuff <laughs> so I think that's uh, yeah we'll, we'll see where it goes we're just uh, uh, putting things together and just um, look what what uh, stands in the end, so it's nothing. Actually, we're, we're not trying to copy anything or anyone. We're just trying to do our own stuff and we'll see what comes out at the end. <laughs> right? Right, and uh, my plan is to um, put some uh, influences in the new work uh, from other countries, uh, music wise, because the plan is to tell fairy tales from all over the world and um, now I'm listening to what uh, comes from other countries for uh, instruments and how they play and I think you can combine that to uh, the uh, lyrics and the songs. Uh, is there going to be more chapters to the story of uh, Ama and Saifia? <laughs> um, First I thought it was over, but I think it's so much fun to continue the story on the albums too. So I will think over another story. <laughs> okay, thank you so much guys and uh, break a leg tonight. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you.